Welcome to the Bowserman Family Nog Recipe uh, segment. Very excited to have you here this evening and uh, run you through our family secret uh, for the holidays. Helps us get through the holidays. We start off with a little Jack Daniels. And for the guys out there, I suggest you pour yourself just a touch to get you through the recipe, okay? Helps get you in the mood. All right, now, we start off here with a little vanilla. One quarter tablespoon. Don't feel like you have to write this down. We'll have it up on the screen here afterwards. Next, we're gonna go with one half pint of brandy, pre-measured. Then we're gonna cruise into a, another half pint of rum. All right, perfect. That goes in next. All right. <clears throat> and then we're gonna go with a full pint of whiskey. I prefer old number seven here. It's got a little bite to it. Okay, that's a pint. That goes in the bowl. Now this is the, po part, uh, the point in the recipe where a guy has to take stock of his life, you know? Have the in-laws been there for three weeks in a row? Uh, is the economy getting to you? <clears throat> Do you just need a little pop to help you through the holiday season? If so, I would suggest to, you might want to hit this a little bit extra. Don't be afraid of it. You're not gonna hurt anything, all right? Next, we're going with a gallon of eggnog. Of course, Model Dairy, a local company, keeping it local. Now, don't be afraid to make this your own recipe, too. I'm gonna give you the, the ingredients we use, but of course, feel free to <clears throat> go ahead and add some things of your own. For instance, Peter not comes to mind, he'd probably put a little beer in here. Whatever, that's fine. All right, next, we are going to the nutmeg. All right, it's very important. We go with two tablespoons of nutmeg. All right. And just a little dash of cinnamon. All right. And finally, we float it with a half a gallon of eggnog ice cream. Unfortunately, they were out of uh, model dairy eggnog ice cream at the store, so I had to go with sunny side. But if you can, again, keep it local. All right. Now, if you need to, you can put some ice cubes in this rascal, but it kind of it kind of dilutes it a little bit. So <clears throat> just start with very cold ingredients right before the party. You see how quick and easy it is to make. All right. Close to a half gallon there. All right. All right. Now, let's stir it up a little bit. And the main thing you're trying to taste here is do you have enough booze in the recipe? And again, it all depends on your mood. All right, so let's stir it up a little bit. Let the egg nog ice cream break down. Let's give it a shot. That's pretty good. So, just to recap, the Bowserman holiday nog recipe, you have one gallon of eggnog, one pint of bourbon, one half pint of brandy, one half pint of rum, two tablespoons of nutmeg, a quarter tablespoon of vanilla, and one half gallon of eggnog ice cream, followed by a couple dashes of cinnamon. And if all of this is too much of a pain in the neck, don't be afraid to go down to the store and just get yourself some Frankovich holiday nog. But I'd try the recipe. Hey, from the Bowserman family, Merry Christmas and Happy New Year.